Greetings, traveler. Uh, I just picked another mage bucket. I've been having a really good time drafting them. Okay. I haven't... Actually, my mage runs haven't been that good, too. I don't know why. Okay, so what do you want to receive? Um, four mana, five, four? Yeah, four mana, five, four. Uh, creeper? Yes, creeper. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> this one, uh, Nightblade? Maybe he likes salty dog. If we, mean, have any, if we had any indication that it would be an aggro deck, right? If I had a fireball right now, I'd be like, fuck it, let's just go Nightblade. Because mm -hmm. we don't, I'd go with salty dog. Because at least there is some option to trade up with a salty dog. Nightblade okay. just dies to a three drop and doesn't do anything against the five drop. Ooh. Conjure still? This one's Kenna's close. pretty good too. It's Kenna's really close, really yeah. I'd go with the Conjure. I prefer to get the value. Uh, like, because Conjure is like the the definition of value, right? It's like mm -hmm. pretty much the highest value cards. Like you have Tome, which is higher value. You have Echo, which is like greedier, higher value. But Conjure is like one of the greediest cards. So I'd go with Conjure. All right. So I think amazing though. So. Uh, of an archer? Yes, of an archer. Mm. Uh, Love Fire Raptor? Yes, Love Fire Raptor. Alright, on um, with the draft. What would you like here, Cece? How do you like the four drop? It's either the four or the mirror. I'm just trying to figure out if it would make sense to pick the mirror. I don't mind the mirror either. Because there's like Valet that synergizes with it. So we can also pick up a Scientist. The Lucky isn't really that great, but it's okay. It's a spell for Waker and Mana Worm. I think I like mm -hmm. the Mirror Entity more. Yeah, it also messes with your opponent's plans. Because we already have a 4 in the Blast Mage. I'm not looking for too many 4s already. Okay. Oh, Thespian. Yes, Thespian. Great to draw. Skylar Crusader. Yep. Premium 3. Casual Drake. Yep. Excellent. Yeah, it's 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 great. We want cards that generate more value. Okay. More twos. Uh, oh wait, phone cards. No, 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 or do you like sheep? Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Uh, oh, I'm not picking. Okay. Yeah, sorry, I, I get I get nervous when I see the Anxious. first order. Especially when people go like <laughs> Oh, this is an easy pick. I know this one, Shady. <laughs> Bam! They're going, yeah, I kind of wanted the other ones. Uh, I think it's the sheep if we look at it, right? Because yeah. we have we have three two drops right now, and sheep just allows us to solve early game. Like, I really hate that this card exists because, well, now with Volcanic Potion, it's even worse. Yeah. But you're pretty much giving mages Consecrate. And you yeah. can't just give a class Consecrate plus Blizzard. Plus, like, it gets kind of hard to play anything at any point, right? Mm -hmm. I, I feel like they're, like playing around Volcanic Potion is wrong because you are giving them time to build up to the thing that they most likely have, which is like Flame Strike. So I think you have to play into Volcanic Potion. It's just frustrating when they have it. Um, so I think it's the same thing with Sheep. Like, I'll make, I'll make advantage. Like, I'll take advantage of it when I'm a mage. I'll pick this card, but I don't like that it exists. It's really... I feel like it's really annoying to play against the mage that can AoE on turn 4 already. It's too early. Yep, yeah. I'll pick the sheep. Long explanation short, sheep is pretty good. <laughs> Alright, uh, Dragon? Or do you like Stormwind? Or do you like... Oh. I think the Dragon is okay, yeah. Because Stormwind's this... usually going to be a 7 mana 6-6. Six, six. So then we'll pick yeah. a 6 mana 6-6. Six, six. Seems good. Dragon's Breath? Mm, I think the two drop. I think the Dragon's Breath is a bit too inflexible. Okay. Yeah. One argument would be that we have sheep, so we can blow up the board, but it's kind of slow. Oh, another six mana, six six. Yes, we like the Drake. So we have two dragons now, like, uh, three dragons, so we can actually pick Dragon Synergy cards from now on. Okay. Polymorph. Yes, yes, yes. Super good card. Oh. We have a lot of fives, don't we? Yeah, we don't want a five. 
I'm not sure whether we want the Tarn Warrior though. Yeah. I think it's probably the Silver Hand, just to combat our opponent's spread. Yeah. Okay. It's not very fun. Mm. Mm. We have one mech, but not the mech we want. <laughs> yeah, this is <laughs> Uh, I think it's still the Technician over the Yeah, board. I think so. At least it is a 3 mana card. Another sheep? Yeah, more polymorph. Yeah, I'll literally take four polymorphs. The card's pretty good. Fireball? Yes. Okay, we're gonna be that other end of the control. We're now actually the control with removal. This is fun. Like, we were playing the previous control that didn't have removal, so it was kind of sad. Uh, Demolisher? We do have the mix synergy, so I think it is correct. It's not a great card for what we're trying to do, but yeah, we'll pick the Nick. Yeah. Is this card good? The Nomish Experimenter? Well, I never picked it. We have a couple it. cards that trigger it, right? One, two, oh. three, four. Yeah, I'd go with the mech. I think it's fine. Okay. Another mech. Oh, oh, two mechs. Yeah. Spider, uh, tank. spider tank. Yeah, spider tank's good. Makes the blast mage better. Uh. Do we want to taunt here? No, no, definitely the two drop. Valet. Two drop, yeah. Want to work on that early game. We need, we need a little bit more early game and a little bit more uh, value. Yeah, Frostbolt. Yeah, our removal is pretty much on point right now. We could maybe pick one more AoE and then we just want uh, lead game value. So you said this deck is leading towards being aggressive. Do we want the one then? Or just evil heckler? Uh, did we I actually say, only have one four draw. Did I say this deck was leaning towards more aggressive or not? Because if I did, that's I not. Thought uh, you... If I no. did, that's not what I meant. Uh, what I what I mean is that right now we have the removal sorted. We just need more uh, value generating cards. Um, but okay. I picked the mistress here. Mistress is just it's triggering. Like you play against an aggro deck, they, you play this on one, you kind of won already. Yeah, it's really demotivating if you're aggro and you see this come out early game. Hmm. Is it the four? I think the four. Or do you like we you have the, the four, right? We have the uh, valet, so secrets are a consideration, but I pick the maiden. Yeah. Speakable here in mage, the effect is quite useful. Oh no, how many sheeps do we pick? Or should we go with oh, the spell sleeve? Definitely sheep, definitely sheep. More sheep. Like I said, I'd easily pick four polymorphs without even like, being in it. <laughs> okay. Uh, this card is just so good. Two? It's like, if a four drop is really bothering you, you can still sheep it. That's fine. We could use another two, right? Yeah, Trog here, definitely. Oh, yeah, Trog. Oh, just some value. Ooh, another valley? Yeah, pick a valley. Come on, last two cards. Let's get some card draw, some value. Scientist! Uh, just quickly okay. checking how many early game cards we're ending up with here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're pretty much at our mark right now. Mm -hmm. We have one AoE with the sheep on top of it. Wow, so Scientist is really good if it pulls the mirror. If it comes down any time after that. Uh, uh, I think the four is fine. Right now we only have two four drop minions, but or you don't really four care if you don't have fours. Right? Overrated in control. It's not necessary. Okay. On the other hand, you could argue that Mad Scientist is value if it pulls mirror entity out of your deck. It's like a mm -hmm. two mana two to draw a card. Which mm -hmm. also gets you insane tempo. I would go for the scientist. I think it's close, yeah. It's just so sick if it hits. All right. Come on. Tome, Coda Rider, some sweet, sweet value. That's fine, I'll take Fallen Hero. That's good value. Fallen Hero? Yeah, yeah, it's good value. We have Fallen okay. Hero made of the lake synergy as well. Okay, CC, ready to go? Ready to go. Right. I have a question, please don't take it as an insult. Is the coaching run with CC a regular crop? Regular crop, all of these. Coachings are either off stream or specified on stream. Uh, full mulligan? Yes, full mulligan. Uh, funky glasses. <laughs> it's late. 
got this. We got the mirror entity. Gotta be careful for the potion of madness. Um, it's actually a little tricky, right? Because we kind of mm -hmm. want to play the scientist, but we also want to be able to trade in whatever he plays so he can't talent priest it. So do you want to play a 3-2 or do you want to play the scientist? What to do? Mm. Usually I would just go for the scientist, but I don't know. I'm not sure. I'd go he for does the puddle. Have... I think it's, yeah, I think it's better. You go for the... The puddle or the raptor, either. Just play a 3 Okay. How many Shady Bunny averages? Uh, for this expansion, I, I have to start guessing a little bit, right? Because the, uh, the tracker, uh, the multi tracker isn't enabled anymore. In this expansion, I'd say right now we're pretty much at seven. Uh, nothing too fancy. Raptor Freaka? Yep. Yeah, I don't want to play the scientist because of Potion of Madness. Yep. <laughs> I agree. I've been I've been pretty much just doing experimentation this entire season, and we're we're pretty much back at seven. So the experimentation started off really slow, and then we got a lot more wins because we got more information. Um, what is this priest playing? Oh, wow. He's playing pretty slow. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! What? <laughs> I'm scared. What is tempo? I don't know what tempo is, man. Oh man. Oh, this is where we really want to ping, but. Oh. I think I would just play the scientist, ping one, free kill the other in three phase. I feel like I if he has Potion of Madness, he has Potion of Madness. It's gonna hit at some point, so. Yep. Yeah. I'll show them. I'll show them all! Um, can you explain the upcoming ranking system? Uh, yeah, sure. So every month they're going to look at all the arena runs you've played. If you've played a minimum of 30, you qualify for a leaderboard. The person with the highest ranking will be number one, all the way up to number 100. Uh, so it's just the average of all your all your runs you've played that month combined. This is awkward. Uh, should I just polymorph that? <laughs> I'm not sure if it's that awkward. Uh, one play is just double trade and four and a one and get the secret out. Because um, we could hit them ping, but that's really slow. And I think. Oh, that you also he... talked about how you like to cash in the death rattle against priest. Right? Yeah, yeah. I think that we're we're just kind of trying to not get potion of madness here, so uh, but at least not on the scientist. So I think trading probably the beast in the two two to play around scrubbits here, and then just oh, wow. playing the mixtures and the beat and the blast mage. And we have the, uh, we have the uh, secret ready. Oh, yeah. Everything he's played so far are all like yeah. draws and. He's draws. he's pretty much full full control priest full value. He's gonna try to AOE us at some point, I guess. But no, for the person asking about the average, um, I try to always experiment as much as possible to learn. Hey Martin, thanks for the sixty minutes. Good to have you back. Um. But I, I had one I had one, you know, season, one expansion called try hearted. And that was um, that was old gods. Oh my god, he drew a potion. It's nasty. In old gods I try hearted, and then I had then I had a uh, Don't you dare, don't you dare. Oh that's fine. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. We got <laughs> The back and forth. Brilliant. That's amazing. We keep this thing alive, right? <laughs> it's fun. So that would mean we'd fall on your opening in phase. Uh... I would mean we'd come in for 10. Yeah, why not? Let's fall in the hero ping in face. Yeah. It's a little uh it's a little greedy, but I guess it's fine. Are are you sure? Are you, you can also trade it in play a six if, but if you want. But it hasn't really shown anything to deal with it, right? 
Yeah. So I think ping and uh, ping with the fallen hero and go face this one. Okay. First one was with Victor, Simon. Same for a Hearthstone stream, not a boxing match. Like yeah. <laughs> nice since we're going at each other. You could also trade a Murloc in. Yeah, I agree. But I think this way you can get the uh, Crusher out probably for the 9 9. Ooh. Fancy schmancy. Eh? That's nice. Guess we can polymorph that. So if you go all face and play a 9 9, you could Shadow or Death and trade the Fallen Hero, which means he'd be at 15. To even heal, it's kind of awkward. What hmm. to do? What to do? I think it's just Crusader ping trade the two two push to six. I feel like we don't want to open ourselves up to a Shadow or Death, right? He's shown us that he can. You don't want to? Okay. Sure. Yeah, we don't need the Polymorph. Then. Polymorph is just a really good value card. It's just we have two in our hands, that's why I keep suggesting it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if you... But we don't have to. So, the thing is, like, if you don't need a Polymorph this game, you're winning, right? If there's mm -hmm. never a target you need the Polymorph, like, you're good. That's fine. I have no time for games. Roll up. That would be an option. <laughs> <laughs> but that is, yeah, that is, that is debatable, right? We can talk about that one. <laughs> <laughs> Right. So yeah, I think you just polymorph the Sylvanas, ping the 1-2, retrade the sheep with the 3-2 and 6-face. Uh-huh. Yep. I think this is, this is really underrated, this style of playing, but this is one of the things I'm writing in my fundamentals guide. It's that if you know your opponent can deal with a particular form of threat, don't switch it up. Mm -hmm. Right? We know we can deal with a spread, so don't play a big minion, because then you give him the chance of playing Shadow or Death and having a tempo swing. Let us see Let us see you do. So what do you want to do with your CC? Mm, ping, kill off, play the 2 and a 5. Uh, yeah. I like that. I wonder. Just making sure we didn't want to just play a 9 9. I think the 2 and the 5 is better. Yeah. Free trade, yeah. yeah. Free trade. <laughs> Three polys, <Yeah>. bogasm. <laughs> yes, uh, it's pretty good, actually. This way, a death and still buffs the truck, right? Yep. Laying around one big removal. Ladies. So is that? It is finished. <laughs> it is finished. You win. Jaina versus Jaina. Jaina versus Jaina. You asked for it. Oh, oh. it is on. Mm, keep the two. Trying to figure out whether Archer is a keep. Mm -hmm. Against Mage, I don't think so. I think just the two is correct. What's the score? It's 1 0, but Tyrande will insist on making it 0 0. Pass. Yup. Ping face. Someday I'll be just like you. I think just the two three is fine. Yep. You do have the secret for value, but I think mm -hmm. having the option to play a three two is probably better. Mm-hmm. Bluffin. So then he trades, plays a four, fireball a four, 
Turn five, we could maiden ping. Could also coin maiden here and then hit ping next turn. Play a blood fan or a demo. This four drop kills the maiden. Kind of awkward. Yeah, I think Raptor is fine. And then next turn we could maybe even Maiden Ping. Let's see. Yeah. So then we'll have a 2-6 versus this 4. Sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got the Raza? Nice, sir. Nice. Yes! Yes! Good, good, good. good work. Oh, wow. Really? Mm -hmm. Really now. Mm -hmm. So it's either made to trade form and still go for maiden ping. Mm -hmm. We kind of like maiden ping again next turn. Yeah, I think we just trade the two three and then maiden coin ping the two one right. I want like trade the harvest golem and then maiden coin ping the two one. Because next turn we want to ping again, killing the other two three and probably fireballing this fight. Okay. Yep. Is okay sure. Make sure, yeah. I was about to say make sure we made him before he <laughs> So he's he's like giving us more free value in that particular phase. Would you ever trade off the three two the two three and play the Admiral Drake? Is that bad? It's just not necessary to draw yet. And I think the the, the ping for one is getting very good value here. Mm. Well, this sounds like exactly what you said. <laughs> yeah, I think fireball and trade ping. It's cool. Yeah. Who's that cute streamer? All oh, right, it's shady. Thank you, it's shady. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> you flatter me, Shalafu. I like that. It's good. Hey, early draw. We might even set up the dream, right? It's called Ara Drake. Well, and then pew 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 pew. Probably not. A lot of pew pews. No, we need one more mana to pew. We get ready for more pew pew. I think we give up on the dream and just go conjure and then trade ping. Is that better? Let's go with conjure. Your mods are abusing power. What do you want here? Cannon? I want the draw against Mage. I want just okay. uh, Arcane Intellect. Okay. More value. More. Yeah, now we just ping trade. Because we have uh, we have all the uh, we have all the answers in our deck, right? There's two more polymorphs ready. Mm -hmm. So I think I'd rather have more card draw. That's really good at this game. Damn. Oh. We're kind of good too. <laughs> As your drag for spot. Yep. <laughs> That's deserved. We have to sink a card into that. He has it, he doesn't, so. Yeah. Wouldn't it be better to use poly since you have many of them? No, polymorph is guaranteed removal on anything. Fireball isn't. It's a low roll. Mm -hmm. It's probably a good moment to get the Koldara Drake rolling, right? Would you ever try to bait out a removal with this? Say again? Would you ever try to bait out a removal with the other 6-6? Six six? <laughs> I think that was my first time, but then I was like, well, am I, am I ever going to get this going on a lesser imposing board? Yeah, okay. No, no, I I'm think it's still it's considering, good. right? Because, I mean, there is there is a huge chance that it won't make it through the turn. Mm -hmm. uh, so if we play the Crusher, we ping, we place things. Like, we'd have to wait with Kondara for quite some time. I... Okay, we'll lead with Crusher. It's fine. Ping face? Ping his face, yeah. Let's see the value. I guess if we ping here, it's more for these guys. 
But it combos with Fallen Hero. <laughs> oh, don't get lucky. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> this reminds me of the one I had with Josh. I don't think Can't you caught be. that, right? Where the opponent no. he Doom Guards, he has five cards in hand. Out of those uh -huh. five cards, he discards a fist, and the fist hits our face for Lethal with the Doom Guard. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what the fuck happened? Okay, we got a polymorph for five, right? Yeah, first thing that comes to mind would be tank poly the five and ping the mm. scarab. Makes sense, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think tank poly the five and uh, the five four and ping the one one. <sighs> yeah, it was insane. I think I might just send the file to troll them and say enjoy. <laughs> like, have a good one, mate. Secrets. Another thing this tracker does, right? Perfect track of all secrets. Um. It's probably not a new burn effigy, right? If he's not trading off the sheep. I think we start by playing Crusader, see if anything happens. I think I'd rather give him that with the uh, mirror entity. For the crusade! Sure. Mm. Trying to figure out if Koldara Drake is too slow here. The thing with Koldara Drake is he might actually kill it, right? Because he's afraid of infinite things. And that would be amazing for us if he like just trades all his minions. Yeah. But I think we go with the Drake and try to bait him into doing that. Like my, my instinct always tells me like, there's no way people do that, but then I remind myself like well, some people just trade, right? They see what this thing could do and then they trade. Mm-hmm. Looks like you might have an Well okay. like, ha! Just use the sheep. Yeah, baited out the sheep, boys, I got this. <laughs> and so, we're pretty much always setting aside 4 mana for Polymorph, which means we're working with 6. 6 means we could technically clear the board with 3 pings in a trade. No, he'd still keep a sheep. The alternative to that is sheeping, trading, and just playing both minions. It's probably better, right? Mm-hmm. He's left with 3 damage, but you get stuff on the board. Yeah, I think sheep the 12, and then trade the 2, 3, and play both minions. Yeah, it's probably... Like, we could even go demo and ping the sheep. We can just play one. Yeah. I think demo and ping the sheep is better, right? Because we don't, we no longer need him to trade with that 2, 3. Yeah. Yeah, so I think, think ping the sheep and demo is correct. Yeah, that's good. This is why Polymorph is an insane value card. If you could just deny any value your opponent wants to get, then... Get in there, yeah. fight, it. Sure. Oh. That's okay, we picked the intellect, right? Yeah. It's, look, this is insane! Oh my god! Oh wow, and he's probably going for it, right? Okay, we're gonna have to intellect okay. So sheep is four, so we're working with six. I think I'd rather mirror entity first, right? Yeah, yeah. I think we want to get yeah, that that's countered. How we do this. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet. It could still be a spellbender, but we can't play around that. So we polymorph this guy. Nice. Uh, yeah, I would just play the creeper to test and trade. Next turn we can draw. The one one. So polymorphs are pretty good. <laughs> polymorphs. Have any more of those? <laughs> no, I think we're out. He doesn't want to play that one. Draw cards. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yep, Tinker Town. I kind of want to get a taunt, because we can't really kill the spiders. Sweet. Oh, here it is. <laughs> no problem. 
What do you want to taunt the spider? Well, we also have a thespian, but I guess it's better to... Or we can taunt the 544. That's, that's the one he's going to remove, though. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I think taunt the creeper and just play, uh, play scientist go face is fine. Do we even put a damage in? No, because demo could miss. Yeah, we just taunt the creeper and play the scientist in go face. Sick RNG manipulation. <laughs> well, if the game doesn't know what you want, then it can't give you what you want, right? So, letting the game know in advance is good to increase the chance that you get what you want. He's like, thanks! It's all in the points, right? So, what kind of a sick bastard holds the flame strike there? <laughs> <laughs> I think we just commit the mixtures for the healing, because we want to be safe, right? And now we just trade a 1 1 and ping and go phase. Okay. Side effects? No. Trust me. We're not missing out on two turn lethal by not playing this, right? Six. Eight, ten. Oh, we are. Oh my god. <laughs> I guess we play it then. Right, oh, shit. right this is ten. Right? bastard. Come on now. Wait, it's not. Oh, Six, eight, ten, thirteen, fourteen. It's not. It is Wait, with a creeper would die, right? Well, but the demo can hit, so. Okay. And that means that he can't get more base. That's also something. Will he be rewarded for the greediest hold ever? Find out next turn! Nope! <laughs> well, she found it off something. She drafted the dragon, right? I think she drafted it, yeah. Uh, DA 314 1592. Thanks so much for the sub. Welcome back for months in a row. Ditch the poly. Mm -hmm. Why do you go? Where do you go? Huh. Creeper? Or do you like the 2 3? I like the Creeper to play around a buff. Yeah. Maybe me too. the value. Job done. You will regret this. Oh. Yay. Oh, hey! Scientist and bump? Scientist and bump, yeah. Oh, do we bump? Part 3 is going here. So we're probably playing Crusader next turn anyway. What are we playing around from not bumping? Well, it's just like, do we need the damage? Because we're going to be playing 2-3 power minions if we know we are going to. Like, just yeah. lower the health on this by one. Okay. I think bumping is still fine, yeah. Just in case he, for whatever reason, wants to push for you know, kind of. Yeah. Buying or selling. If he coils, then that's actually good. So we have some power. Do you need a blessing? So it's in games like these. Wait. What? Thank you. <laughs> the bump made a misplay. It's good. Oh, secret! Yeah, that's, that's insane, this turn. So we shoot the Wrath Guard, we trade, we trade. Well, well Wait. fucking played. <laughs> yeah. And then we play Mistress on top. Oh my god. Yeah? You like I guess it? We don't have to Mistress, but yeah, Valet, the fort always happens, and then trade, trade happens. Because he does kind of just kill the Mistress for free. And he gets the health back. The next turn we can play a 3 and a 1 anyway. So yeah, I think holding the Mistress actually works out. But oh my god. <laughs> what is that? I mean, yeah. he kind of brought it on himself, right? With the uh, with the way how he played it, but... Oh my god. Yeah, it's right there. Go. <laughs> Do it! That's a pretty good minion to play in your entity, because... You take... I guess it doesn't really matter, right? You take the damage anyway. So one thing we could do is just play the mixtures and the Crusader. 
And then free kill the 2-2 two -two with the 2-3 in gem phase. I think that's okay. What are you thinking? Yeah, I think that's okay. Okay, let's do that then. For the crusade! Side effects? No. Trust me. I'll oh, probably have to jam this into something. So we got into his head there by trading with the creeper. That's good. You're in trouble now. Sure thing, buddy. Okay. So we either play the five or we frostbolt and play the three, right? Even polymorph and then kill it with the two two. Oh, I think playing the five in all phases is correct. Yeah. 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 Squire, Trade the orc. No thanks. Ready, sir. <laughs> I think the orc is doing just fine on his own. I think so. He's like, damn, he didn't fall for it. I lured him into my perfect trap here. Such a good trade. Their opponents played Crawl into Morganus. What's the fuck? Shit happened. Do you want a polymorph? The 4-5? You could poly and frostbolt even in gem face. Because he doesn't have a hosen, I think, right? He would have hosen instead. Yeah, I think poly the 4-5 always happens. Yeah. Just trying to figure out whether we ping or frostbolt. I think we frost, we... I think we frost the 5-4 and then use the 2-2. Two and two. Two, two. No, not the mistress, the other one. So frostbolt the 5-4. And then use the squire to kill the sheep and go face. Because if it's red in front of you, don't want them to heal off that or coil or whatever. It's turn seven now, though. Should play more around. Um, yeah, the but other if he has missiles, he shoots his own five one, and then he will uh, he will only heal for one because the damage goes to his face, and then we can polymorph it in gem three. Yeah. Pretty good frame, but it's not the end of the world for us. Oh no, capping. Why just trade off the shield? Well, I guess we don't have to. We can jam phase too. It's either Tinkertown ping jam 5 phase or Koldara trade the 2 1 into the 5 and jam 3 phase. Yeah. Hey, JD Baker. Thanks so much for the 3 months, man. Welcome back. The problem I have with not using Koldara now is that we can't poly plus Koldara. Hey. So I think I would use Koldara now and then trade the 2-1 into the 5-1 and 3-phase. It's more vulnerable to Blast Crystal, but it's going to come out at some point. And PO as well. Yeah, 5 go face I think trading here is madness. Madness! Oh no, not the top deck. What is it? Well, don't top deck me, Gul'dan Senpai. <laughs> well played. Oh. Trading is for the weak and the virtuous. Real warriors go face. It's really not that often. Did you guys get the uh, Firelands? No. No Firelands, no Fireball, no Polymorph. No Mage cards. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. We had, we had the value, right? We had the Conjures. Conjures were great. Oh no, let's throw the mirror back. Uh, I think so. It's like cool, right, to do. Uh, we have a Scientist, so yeah, I think just the value is fine. Yeah. This is way too slow, Winter 5. <laughs> If I hear the words XXX again, I'm gonna claw my ears off. I don't want you to do that squid, so it's cool. Synergy. I didn't realize we had two valets. It's pretty cool. Start with one valet? Yep. Job's done. Excuse me. You are mm, I wouldn't put priest in top four. 
I think you're just gonna stick with top three and go Mage, Rogue, Warlock. Mage, Rogue, Warlock. Oh, thanks! So we really want to play Raptor. But oh. Mm. He didn't keep anything, so I think Raptor in two faces, right? <laughs> Gulchan? <laughs> Well played. Well played. I told oh no, he ass. got it. Yeah. Well played. I'm better at this game than you are, Jamie. Let's go. We, we bought ourselves control for demo into Blast Mage. Let's see who, we'll see who played well here. Go get him, demo. Go get him! Wow. wow. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna squelch him. It's fine. I'm just gonna RNG the shit out of this kid. Alright, just no thinking. Just Blast Mage. Go! You got him. Oh, trade. Let's, <laughs> let's land him with a thank you. That's good. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Give him the thank you! Alright, there you go. <laughs> How's your Potion of Madness doing now? Oh, oh no. Come on, play a two drop so we can mirror into T Valley. Like, trigger him a little harder. Finally, oh, yeah. Ready for another emote, CC? He started this. Oh, I didn't yeah. hit. So, mirror into T Valley is guy. I just go with a well played. There's Jam Face. Excuse me, you are on the well played. He's being maged, maged to the maximum right now. We're just getting. Oh, okay. Do we win this turn? So if we ping, that's eight, ten, seventeen. Yeah, it's people ping the wargan. We win, right? Yeah, it's. it's There's so much easy. damage. Just ping the wargan and kill him. Oh man, how how one little cocky like, oh, I don't think the push of man is snowballed into insta loss. Feels good. Counter BM boys. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Feels good. I missed the sorry emote. Yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. Just like the entire game. <laughs> I, I only do it if they start, guys. It's so fun. If they, like, if you could see them like being all smug because they top decked you, and then you just like the entire game, like sorry, sorry, sorry. Not quite all those plans, Bible Thumb. <laughs> You wanna just keep the archer? Because it's a hunter. Use the maximum insults. Yeah, use a top deck. You have like a disappointed face in chat because we didn't use a top deck. Uh oh. Coin the puddle? That was pretty disgusting. Yeah, Blast Mage is such a bad guy. That was a 4 mana 5 4 battle cry deal. That was a 4 mana 5 4 fire rally. That's disgusting. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely okay. disgusting. Do I attack here? No, I play Thespian and then pass. Unless it's hidden cash. If it's hidden cash, we go face. An autograph? Hmm, I suppose. Nope. Yes. Right, is hidden cash a spell or a, or a card? Because it, I think it's a card, right? Plays a minion or something? I don't know. That card's so bad, I never see it, so I don't know when it triggers. Uh, I'll just Archer's guy, ping his guy. And pass? Yep. Like, we have complete board control, right? If I'm under really pressure, we win. So. What do you think about Counterspell in Arena? Uh, it used to be really good during the Firelands Portal meta. Now I think it's okay. It's nothing too crazy. Polymorph. 
Kill it with the murloc? Kill it with the murloc? Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. we did it! That's good. Uh, now we kill it with the taunt, right? Because that's where it yeah. takes. Yeah, and then go face. It's pretty good board control versus enter. We have a 5 if we need to. We have sheep if he keeps its stealth. Trade into this other stuff. Sure. I'm glad we got rid of the Hellmaster. Holy shit. That have sucked. Really now? I'm guessing it's Conjure. I'm just considering Drake instead, right? Yeah. I think Conjure is fair. Because we can look for something to potentially deal with the Captain Hat, maybe a Flame Cannon for next turn or something. You want it? I got it. I think out of these options, you could go for Nova, but next turn we could go for Drake Mirror Image. Huh. We'll go for Nova, it's a safe pick. And then the 3 1 into the 5 4, uh, four 3. So the taunt into the 4 3 and go face. I think it's a close pick, right? Yeah. Would you have gone for the Mirror Image on your own? Probably, I think so. But but there's also hounds, right? Given like dogs. Yeah. I was thinking about hounds. But... I just think Frost Nova is such a frustrating card when you're playing Hunter. It's just like you never play around that card in specific. I feel. Mm -hmm. oh. Trade. Trade is mirror. I'm you sorry. We could also go for Mixtures Mirror Entity and then ping the 2 2 and kill that. And then he'd be left with a 2 3, we'd have a mirror. We do have uh, two valets left in the deck, so that's a consideration. Do we ever Nova here and just play the spider and the one? Mm, I think that's too slow. I think the Drake is fine. It's probably just Drake and the one. That's right. Let's see what we get. Yeah, we'll just trade, play the one, go one phase. There's no need to pay. Getting the development out. It's the two valets that make me want to hold this a little bit. It was the snap job prophecy again, followed by Hamaster right away. Yeah, I have this I have this rule that if your opponent plays a snap jaw is gonna master it. Ready to go. If he's at the reasonable wins, right? If it's if it's game mode, we don't care. We could use the Drake and the Mistress to kill the Hungry Dragon, and then trade the Trog into the Socialite and go Trog Salty Dog. And if he doesn't play too much good, we could just Nova and start jamming face with the Salty Dog. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think I like the Trog more than the Creeper. Because we have, on one hand, we have Sheep, and on the other hand, he's got to get a 2 3 here. So, Alright. Yeah, I think 4 and 2 into this 5 6, and then 1 3 into the 2 1. Something that I can try. So we're still pretty healthy, and we have the board, we have the cards. Alright. The one thing that bothers me is Kraken. I'm not sure how much I want to play around it. Because you can polymorph and mirror entity here. I, I, I kind of want to do that. I kind of. Because I feel like. He's the, been holding that car from the first. Yeah, turn. one of the only ways you lose here is he Krakens your salty dog, right? Yeah. Like we burn our polymorphic Krakens our salty dog. So I think Poly the uh Poly the Lord of the Arena is totally fine and then mirror entity is also good. Uh, so we'll start yeah. with that. Okay. And we'll see which trades were. I think the free kill is probably fine. With the two three into the we want to trade the draw the stalker here. I want to 
want to kill the beast. More yeah, so. I think two, three into the beast and face for eight is fine. I mean, this is more vulnerable to the ID and stuff. Hmm. Yeah, but I think I agree with killing the beast. All right. Easiest Kraken of your life, buddy. Let's go. He's, he's testing, he's like, no. He's like, do I want to play Call of the Wild? Oh, no. Oh, that works. Oh, oh, he doesn't have it. We both yeah. did that one drop stuff. That's kind of fun. This might be the Frost Nova turn, right? Because this is the board where it gets a little bit of value. I wonder. Saves the 1 1. We get to push some face. We save some health. Yeah. The other one is we play the sheep, but then we kill off our own camel. That feels wrong. I think Creeper Nova ping the 2 1. Uh, I'm definitely pushing one face with the Trog. Yeah, Nova and Ping the two ones happening. I'm just trying to figure out if we ever go. Uh, Creeper is also happening. I'm just thinking whether we ever preemptively hit. I don't think so because we have the sheep, right? So I think Creeper and face is fine. Unfortunate that day for us, but he didn't have much choice, yeah. so he had to go for it. So he's gonna need to not have unleashed the hounds, I guess. It's the thing I'm playing. The thing I'm thinking about is silver hands freeze the bog, crack the creeper to prep for potential oh, sheep. That would be four damage on this guy right now. We could even ping it. We could even kill it. Three, four, play around the holes or whatever he could have. And then we'd have Silverhand Knight and a 2-2, two, two, the two one ones versus Camel. So Silverhand comes down, Frostbolt yeah. his guy happens, always. I'm pretty sure ping his guy always happens. Yeah, I think we just throw everything in. It's not worth getting super wrecked by Unleash the Hounds or Hosen or whatever. It feels bad because you lose out on the uh, potential sheep value, you lose out on the... the yeah. Unleash the Hound says, what, two less bodies? Hausen doesn't have a target. <laughs> He's, tired for a little He's still holding this card. Yeah, I don't know. What is it? <laughs> it's trading. What could it's it be? Scary. Oh. So what is he holding here and it's trading? It feels like 4-4 four, four kills a 2-3 and then we just town spin the 2-2, two, two, the 2 phase. 4-4 four, four kills the 2-3, yeah. Yeah, and then we just fall on hero, ping the 2-2, two, two, push 2. I don't know, I have no idea what it is. <laughs> if it's a kill command, he would have either kill command or 4-4 four, four, push face, right? Yeah. If you're like, it's kill command, there's no way you trade or face damage. But why would he trade if it's face damage, guys? I just don't understand. Lock and load is something I was also thinking oh, about. Oh, oh, there it is, there it is, what is it? Oh, he was waiting for Tom, okay, that's, I can understand. Wait, whoa, okay. I can understand. That is a really, 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 really good explosive for him. I guess we just, or two, I, oh my god. The thing is we might, we might end up sucking the 3-2, right? Uh -huh. So I have to think about bear as well. How do we deal with a bear afterwards? One into his face, and then three two. If it's a bear. Are we ever just trading the one and the four to this this one? Because otherwise the shapes don't really add up anyway. And keeping the fallen hero is kind of cool. We're 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 kind of dying though. It doesn't. I guess. Okay. I, I think one one into the five five to test is fine. It could be snakes. Or oh, take on our feet. Oh boy. Okay, perfect. Uh, probably then play Maiden, play Spider, ping his guy. Trade the 3 2, push 5. It's fine. We'll just give you extra power. Seems a joke. You don't, you don't think the Fallen Hero has more power? 
Well, we push one additional damage this turn that way, right? Because we're always yeah. wasting some kind of damage. Yeah. Oh, this we got is it. Four, though. five, seven. Yeah. This is perfect now, right? Yeah. Yeah. I see. It's the same thing, right? The other one would be a three with extra ping. Yeah. yeah. But you'd ping one more. You would have lost one damage last turn, right? Yeah. But this turn, it would be the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is scary. We're gonna need to try and get some really good defense going. 5 0 Warrior is probably gonna be pretty aggressive. Keep the truck. How defensive do you want to be? <laughs> Just a truck. I want a hard mode for sure. <laughs> Elven Archer, Mistress of Mixtures, uh, Sheep, Frostball, just anything to defend. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Yeah, this oh, is no. a great start. Oh. You want to play the one? I probably want to play the one. I just want to consider if it's ever worth getting the scientist out and saving the healing. I don't think it is. It's either you could also start with Drog into scientist into Mr. Spin potentially. Mm. No, Mistress is fine. If it's if it's Warax, you've saved mana. If it's a 3-2, you've saved mana. If it's a 2-3, it's unfortunate. That's cool. Mm, side effects? No. Trust me. The coin is still useful. Okay. Yeah, we just gained, oh. gained the coin here. That's great. So many options. Yeah, it's tempting to get the scientist rolling, but you just want to have three damage, right? Going into hired gun, so I would just trade yeah. the raptor. Like, there's there's obviously the argument, but what if we draw into the secret? Yeah, I mean, the, the chance of us drawing into a secret is much lower than just one big three damage. Here, so. Four threes are just way too common right now. Yep. Not even that. Like just three threes. Wow. Like maybe even a raging dragon. Oh this yeah. Not too bad either. So now I'm actually considering him having um, a Rafi Weaponsmith, so I don't think developing the puddle is that great here. Hmm. Poppy is one win behind on the title. Um, yeah, the title, I'm not editing. I'm editing just the in-game score. The title is missing the tier on the win. I actually hmm. don't really know. That's really annoying, two four. Do you want to kill it? It's either scientist trog or trade pink trog. Mm -hmm. I guess it's always trog. Yeah, I think we go for coin scientist in three phase because it feels like we're gonna be able to ping next turn if we just get the scientist rolling. Yeah, not just phase. So if he weapon smits the 3 2, he kills the scientist, we can trade back. Or we can even kill the. Okay, no weapon smith. Sure. It's actually okay for us. Yeah. We're not too bothered. Puddle ping to face. I agree. Yeah, the blast damage just doesn't do much into the dead spot. CC a streamer? Yes, absolutely yes. Go make sure to go give her a follow. Follow the moderators can put her stream in the chat. Much appreciated. Thank you, Jamie. Uh, Sorry, I'm not I'm kinda quiet today. <laughs> it's it's fine. It's fine. I feel like I'm talking way too much No, no, no. So, someone Thank has you. to shut up with that time, time, so here. <laughs> Uh, That's a big minion. Oh, next turn. Conjure. I 
think so. It's like it's a lot of tempo gone if he suddenly goes like full range, smack smack, and goes phase. So that's the only thing, consideration. I think if he goes, if we have a polymorph it now, but I think conjure is correct. It's a play to win. The play to win is conjure. You want it? I got it. I got it. More mm. card draw. It really depends where this game is going, right? I think the card draw overall should be correct. There's three polymorphs and a fireball in his deck, so card draw should be correct. Mm. To face. Face. I need to talk. You can just sing. Yeah. <laughs> Last Mitch combo? Yeah, yeah, I guess. I've actually had to do this with Merps one time. We had to use our sheep to combo Blast Mitch. It's pretty funny. Okay, did he just try? Yeah, I think so. It looked like it. Okay, I'll find it. Who trades there? Uh, see, see, explain this. Who trades there? <laughs> so, I don't know, but he's dying. <laughs> that's true. How is he dying? <laughs> I don't know. What happened? <laughs> Took a conjure to the face, sure. This is this is when you know like the game is going okay, right? When you're like, we haven't been, we haven't touched him. How is he dying? He's like, I've been killing myself. <laughs> it's either Thespian Blast Mage here or Burn the Polymorph. I don't think we draw. So I think Thespian Blast Mage is a play. It means that he probably uses his uh, Yeti on the, the Thespian and takes another five. And yeah. yeah, I'm okay with that. It's fine. Yeah. I guess, yeah, he's burned three weapon charges so far. On minions, yeah. Oh, Marta, are you still here? Is there a, is there a party pants in the house? Yeah, yeah, I have a question for uh, audiology. Oh my god, he just. It's like, well. Alright, let's find some damage. Fireball for the game. <laughs> oh my god, I. No, not oh wait. We can't intellect. <laughs> Sky will grow. We can't, we can't. <laughs> just just quickly throwing that out. Unless we plan on polymorphing it regardless, then we might. Uh, uh but don't we oh. No. The thing is you yeah. can polymorph ping and elven and push three. I think that's better, right? Oh yeah. I almost did it! Oh my god! <laughs> I did it once, that's why I'm saving you the trouble. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we just poly his guy. Uh, I guess technically we should ping the Yeti first, right? Maybe we get a spare part. I wonder. That changes our mind. That's not drawing, right? It's not drawing, okay. no. Uh, discovering is not drawing. Uh, getting spare parts and stuff is not drawing. Yeah, we just polymorph and Elven the one and three phase. You don't see Marta on the list. Okay. Order. The next turn, this guy can do two damage. <laughs> Beautiful. Then she kind of lies, right? She was one shot, one kill, but she cheats. Yeah. It's two shots. <laughs> okay. Hey, oh my god! Who does that? Stop! 5 0 warrior, guys. He's like, mm, what could I discover that could possibly more use, be more useful than a 3 6 taunt here? It's like, ah, right, 4 damage on my guy. Come on, fireball. I'm tired of you, warrior. Go away. Love oh, polymorph okay, or that. Card. Let's use polymorph. Got him. Yay. You misplayed so much as Warlock against Reporter. Yeah, I did it one time. Let's pick up. I will fight with honor. You asked for it. <sighs> Salty dog goes. Scientist stays. We have one one drop to look for. We have two real three drops other than this to look for. I don't think that's enough. I think the technician stays, right? 
Okay. Yeah. Under normal circumstances, he goes, but in this particular deck, I don't think so. Yay, polymorph. <laughs> oh, good draw. Job's Very good draw. How do you know it's a 5 0 warrior? Well, we are 5 0, and your opponent is always in the range of that. Uh, so, with a lack of better information, I assume the, the record is the same. Because I feel like it'll be more likely to be the same than something different. Yeah. Oh, everything uh, but the coin? Yep. Okay. In a way, I don't mind that, because that's no true silver, no kings in hand, and all that bullshit. So free kill no matter what, right? Yep. I think it's probably still Crusader, right? Even though we could get cute with the spare parts, the demo if it misses, we can just lose the game on the spot. Yeah, yeah I think the Crusader is correct. Because if he if his two drop is a four three, you just okay, insta kill. Very nice. Yeah. Okay. The Demolisher is quite tempting, though, on an empty board with a follow-up. Mm -hmm. I think you can, you can defend it even better if you lead with uh, the 3-1, right? Yeah. Now we double try and play Demolisher. Um, so we could also free kill Trog and Ping. We could double mm -hmm. trade. And Maiden, I don't think we double trade demo. I think using the shield and then Trog and ping his guy is fine. Because then next turn we can go demo ping again uh, if we want to. You don't want to get the moon? Not yet. I, th I feel like he'll probably be able to play around it. Most people can. So I I'd rather just ignore it for a little while longer. You want to ping and play Trog, right? Yeah, ping and play Trog. Because he can't really Consecrate. He didn't have Consecrate. This was his top deck card. So. Yeah, he, he doesn't have it in his card. Whoa. Doesn't even do that much, right? Because we held the... Because uh, we held the, the Scientist on the board. Yeah. So, one play is just using the 3 1 and the 2 1 in the 5. Free kill, maiden, mistress. Our board is 2 6, 3 1, 2 2. Next turn we can play double 3. Um, we could also polymorph, but that's a little bit overkill. Yeah, I think that's just strictly better, right? The double trade yeah. into the 5 and the free kill. Yeah. This is something I've been doing against these uh, buffetins. It's like they're extremely slow in terms of like not trading up. Four and a one. Right? Yeah, four and a one. I've just been holding my minions on the board as long as possible, like trading really, really, really. Yeah. They don't want to deal with your stuff. They just want to play strong minions. So I just trade extremely greedily. I hope you like my invention. Oh no. I mean, zero mana to two. I'll take it. The worst thing. Oh, that was so awkward. It's actually fine. We just go demo with Tinker Town and then trade the two power guys into the gun. Trade the two six into the two. Yeah. yeah. Three mana two into actually. Uh, did we play it? No, we didn't play it. It came from the scientist. So zero mana two two. No, a, a two into wisp. That's okay, right, guys. What would you pick? Preparation, Doomsayer, Dirty Rat, second pick, Doomsayer. Dirty Rat and Prep are pretty much unplayable in the arena. <laughs> dirty Rat. I don't like Dirty Rat in the arena. Can we get him low enough? Maybe not. Hmm. So our guys go face. And we can face. So it's always happening. I think Salty Dog, Armor Plate, the Salty Dog's probably as good, right? And the next turn we get to 9 9. 
Yep. Get back, you scurvy dogs! Job done. Because if he has Aldor or Ildeman, it probably hits the 7 5 anyway. And then the 9 9. It's pretty good. Let him face the salty dog. Oh, maybe yeah, we could have bought the 1 4 and make it really annoying for him, too. Mm, you mean play the 6 6 in the middle? No, but... play the se 7. He has to take the 7. Oh. I'd, I'd kind of rather have a 7 5 on the board. Ah. Uh -huh. That. That looks like a polymorph. <laughs> uh, three damage of lethal as well. But yeah, polymorph is looking pretty good. Yeah. Holy the guy, ping, pretty kill with the maiden face. No need to burn the bolt here. Nope. Good, good, good. Every dragon is pressure dreams of becoming a 9 9. Thank you for letting his dreams come true. Well, your opponent might concede, so it might not be a 9 9 at all. Sure. <laughs> so, if it's not get down, he's dead, right? So, 2 2 goes face. Okay, GG. Oh. Gotta play the 9 9 before we kill them, CC. Oh, okay, okay. Don't wanna play with them, <laughs> No, I'm good. I'm good. That'll be me. Okay. Got it. Got it. Yes. 7 0, guys. Not bad. Watch your back. You asked for it. Oh, yeah, I think your stream still says 6 0. So. Yeah, I need to update it at the start of the game, and the title will be a bit behind. I've given up on that. It's all around this fault. Two and a three? Yep, yeah, two and a three. It's a very good draw. The Crusader is pretty much our only... Like, that and the tank are our only good threes. So. Yeah. Is Shady's chair making a sound? Yeah. Like, when I rock it, it like... So it needs to go like once in a while, whatever. Pass? Yep, yeah, pass. Greetings from beyond the grave. Do you want to? Yep, to drop. This is a pretty <laughs> scary, scary game. It's if we fall too far behind, it's uh, like he goes buccaneer here or whatever. Pretty nasty. Only good threes. Demos has been good to use this run. Oh. That's acceptable. Okay. Yeah. That would have made one crusader really bad. Crusader? Uh, Elven Ping would clear. The only, the only reason why I'm considering Elven Ping over Crusader is he can't really interact with that clear, whereas he can interact with the Crusader if he has one damage. Mm. Oh. Mm. Okay. That would mean he isn't playing a 4. So if he Elven Ping and he smacks, it's pretty much the same deal. Just don't take the damage. Yeah, I would Elven and Ping. I would. It's just safer, right? It's just. Just means that's where we are not giving him any options to remove our guy. Yeah. If you think about it, if he uses face on the one one, it's pretty much exactly the same thing that would happen if we would trade. A crusader, right? Yeah. Yeah, except now we don't take the three from him going face. Your mother was a Wait, where is he hitting? There. We like this guy. <laughs> Is, is it? It's probably a combination of three and a two or a five, right? Yeah. So if we were to go for Crusader Creeper, we have three and a one. That's kind of hard to deal with. If we go for a knight, he might just eviscerate the knight, which is awkward. So I think the Crusader and the Creeper is correct. Positioning's probably the Crusader in the middle, funny enough. 
I think that's the correct one for the trail. Do you run it in? No, no we have creeper. So just deal with three one in. Average turtles! Thank you for three months in a row. Welcome back, man. Good player, yeah. <laughs> he knows the place. He could go bump Skulker, but then you just trade. It's not that bad. Lol. <laughs> you want to do that, Cece? It seems pretty good, right? Yeah. Make sure I play the, the, the secret first. I think we suck the creeper here. I think we want more power to kind of pave the way for the Cold Hour Drake to come down. You can dagger and skulker. Oh my god, just as I was trading the creeper, I was thinking, is, all of a sudden I was just thinking, is Shady being sarcastic about trading the creeper? I was like, no, no, he isn't. He did me. Kind of nice when it totally killed you. Yeah, but you can just continuously make plays around Phantom Knives. If you are continuously thinking, oh, if my opponent has one damage uh, to all my guys, I'm in a bad spot. You're gonna, like, I'm not even I'm not even bullshitting, right? But the fear of playing around that is gonna stop you so much that you're going to play... You're gonna have such subpar plays that you're gonna lose against uh, a lot of people who don't have fan. And there's more people who don't have fan than people that have fan. And then at the same time, there's even more hands that don't contain fan that's, than that's contain fan, right? So. Uh, Play the six. Kill his Borg. Yeah, play the six. Trade the one ones into the three. Another one one yeah. into the loot. And the two three into the one one. Yeah, yeah. You want to play the Drake, right? Yeah, for sure. Oh, uh, if you... Um, yeah, the reason we, we don't allow the quest trading is because there are a shit ton of bots and scammers in that as well. And the EHS. And it's kind of hard for us to like say, okay, you can do it, you can do it. Come on. I've only, I've only heard about this in stories. I've never actually seen it. Uh, kind of sad part is he kills it, right? Because he gets a weapon. Yeah, or we can polymorph it. Yeah, but then again, but we want to keep it up. Ping, ping. This one is six, three, it's three, it's here, we ping back. The other one is, oh, it's just too good, right? Yeah, we just fall in here and ping the 4 4 twice. And then I would jam 8 phase. Especially with the Chow on the board. A second chance. You convinced me? Alright, I'm happy for that, Katsu. Because this is something that holds a lot of people back when they're playing Arena, right? They're, they're continuously afraid about so many cards that they make subpar plays and then they just. They just have worse boards, and then they lose because of that, rather than developing. We have the ping dreams, the Kader the Drake with the Maiden, yeah. and the, the one yeah, that the just combo. <laughs> the forbidden combo. Polymorph. Ping, play the, uh, this guy. Say again. Polymorph the five fives. Ping the two one. Play puddle salter. You could ping twice if you want. Uh, oh, instead of playing the puddle salter. Yeah, you could also just play the knight and ping the chow. Save a polymorph. Yeah. You're right. Maybe that's better. Yeah, I think knight on the left and being a child is correct here. Yeah. 
Squire, attend me. Ready, sir. I feel like one of the only ways we lose if it goes like bog and we can't answer it. So I think having yeah. a poly ready is better. Yeah. If, we, if we have another poly in hand, I'd be down to pulling here. I just wanted to keep this guy healthy, but it's probably not worth it. Oh. I mean, if he wants to take six here and trade the five, that's the deal. Mm -hmm. Another opponent trying to kill himself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can you can protect your Drake here, but if you then burn your poly and he ends up having removal and then has a threat, you can actually lose. Whereas I feel with this kind of a line, with the poly ready to go, I don't think we lose. Well, it's cheating! That's cheating! Now I have this card! Well, if we had one more mana, he'd be dead, right? Because we could pink face, pink face, pink face, pink face, pink face. That's hilarious. Oh, if we drew Maiden, that's lethal, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So, one thing I'm considering is just pinging the Frost Elemental three times at six and then just playing a Puddle and jamming six phase. Pretty good for value. He'd be pretty low. We could also just put him on one HP now. But then yeah, we are kind of all in that. game, not having any healing or... Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think, I think three times ping the Frost Alley. And then play Puddle Stomper, six faces better. Oh, it runs out on me. Oh no, refresh. It's so tempting to protect your nice card support. Do you think a lot of players try to protect your cards too much? Yeah, yeah, for sure. There's there's a lot of there's a lot of times where people they I'm not sure if it applies, but it's more like just some cost value where they they protect the minion and then they keep protecting it. And then they they start doing irrational plays because they want to keep that minion alive. Whereas you have to look at it like this. If a minion has already killed three things or whatever, that's a deal, right? If, if every one of your cards trades for three cards, he's out of cards in no time. Hmm. Whereas if you start dumping a ton of cards and trying to protect it or taking huge risks trying to protect it, you might just lose. He did just cover a getting touch. Uh, he picked the Auto Barber, right? So we knew it, we know it's this cover card. What's the gift in the middle? Oh, there he's in the It show. is. A secret. It's the Swashbuckler, right? Yes, yeah, Swashbuckler. So if that is a mirror entity, our opponent has six on this Dragonhawk Rider, five here. We might have to polymorph, so I. What to do? Mm, it's a little tricky. I think I'll just play the trog and see what happens. Okay, now we can... Is there any way we die? Cold blood, right? Cold blood on this guy. 7, 14, plus 5, 19, 21. He's 3 off with a cold blood. I don't think I take the chance here. I think we just poly the wind fury. And then ping his face. Sure. It's still ping his face. Yeah. If he has the lethal now, then sure. Then he would have had he would have need to have a counter spell type effect and cold blood and Two more damage or something. If I roll need. That He's like, I can't, I can't ping that. I can't ping that. Yeah, I can't stab my own What's this? <laughs> Let's see. Oh my god. GG. I'm gonna go for the fancy lethal. Alright. Alright. You do it, let's go. Let's go! <laughs> you got him. I'm not gonna argue that it's the highest percent win chance, but 
it just gives you the the insight of why I play around certain things on certain positions. The more you're winning, the more you can play around very outlandish stuff, like very weird, weird combos. Keep the toes. You might keep last mage. You don't really have fours. Yeah, I think the twos and the blast mage is fine. Okay. Would you click? Oh, okay. Depends on what we get. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really work though. I'd still coin the belly. Like it's, uh... On the other hand, if we coin the 3 2 and he has a 2 HP minion, we can save it. That's greedy. We can also pass and coin into fours and then keep the valet combo for uh, for turn five. That's pretty sick as well, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I think I actually like that. They can fall behind a little bit, but you have sick turn five with mirror entity belly. Yep. It's not too slow, is it? No, it's not. Like you, you play, you play pretty fast on on five then. And against the mage trying to develop too fast, might just end up giving him a play with removal. <laughs> Does this change anything? We fall on hero, he trades, he plays a three, we coin last mage or maiden. We play Medivh's valet. He plays a thing. We could play Fallen Hero Coin Ping that way. It would mean that we are not locked into Maiden. And if we go Fallen Hero, if we go Fallen Hero uh, Ping on four, we could go Maiden Ping on five to protect it. Yeah, I think Valet is actually correct now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I like it. The more we talk about it. Because it's like you kind of get the ping from the mirror entity then on five by getting the fallen hero to ping. And this means we don't have to play both fours because it's unlikely they're both good at the time we play it. Easy mirror. Who plays minions on three? I am not a morning person. So here we actually could go for Fallen Hero, Coin Ping, trade the one, put him in a little bit of an awkward spot. That would mean that he trades the Imp Master off with a ping, plays a 2. We have a 2-2. Two, two. He can't play Water Alley or anything. I think I like it now, right? Thunder the Greedy yeah. face it. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, Fallen Hero, Coin Ping, the 3-2. Okay, because you really don't want to jam your Impmaster into a 3 2. Yay, free kill. Free kill! Hey, rats. How you doing, man? Oh, Rathma, hi. We must cleanse the sun. Ah, let's go. Oh, no! Don't you dare! Oh! It's not too bad. Maiden's actually okay on this board, right? We could ping the 2 1, but she's pretty much killing herself, so he needs to trade her off anyway. So that would trade into the 2 2. He'd have a 1 1 and a 3 2 and a 5. We could fireball the 5, ping the 1, trade the 3 2. We'd have a 2 3 left going into a 6. The other place puddle ping, he trades trades, it's more awkward, right? I think the maiden is correct, from what I can tell, yeah. I am freed okay. from the awesome. You still good on time, by the way, Susie? Because I know it's getting late. Uh I'm okay. okay. It's six. <laughs> it's okay though. Oh hi Otiger. <clears throat> It just means that you you have to um, keep keep doing all this thinking. <laughs> okay, sure. Because I, I feel like I'm, I feel like normally I I'm try really... to dip yeah. it down a little bit, but I feel like now you're you're probably getting more and more tired, right? So 
Okay. Oh. Still needs to trade off the two one. If it plays the water elemental, we probably still fire the fireball. So. This means we could just play the glass mage and ping. Oh, face. Ooh, okay. He's going face. That's what? wrong. That's wrong. He has to trade. Because otherwise, he starts to lose taunts as well. It's not good for him. Oh. <laughs> Where, where's that guy? Where's that guy from the draft that was like, man, Bone Guard's so much better than Explosive Sheep? <laughs> Alright, Sheep, ping the Sheep. It's Seems one mana ping too. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we can play the puddle after. It's pretty sickening. Wrecked. Wrecked. Consecration in Mage is fun. Smiley face, smiley face. Well met. Sure. King the three two, so we can trade it. Where did the board go? <laughs> what happened? What face? Reporting for duty. Oh. Don't like flame strike. Oh. I don't. I think it's still the right line, right? You, you trade the three into the three, you ping the one, you play the knight and go face for two. I yeah. yeah. I mean, this already killed and got its value already. Yeah, Maiden is getting the value. So maybe. I'm okay with that. Custom made improved twice, I think. Well, yeah, it's a volcanic potion, right? It's it's a volcanic potion. And it was actually three mana, because it was only one mana for the ping. So. <laughs> volcanic potion, right. it's... Yeah, whatever. We don't need to go down that road again, but you guys know how I dislike that card. Mage yeah, having access okay. to early AoE. Oh. I'll do that. What? Pretty much a flame strike, but we get to keep a 4 2, so we don't mind that. That's an improvement. I'm guessing it's 4-2, uh, sorry, 4-3. I'm just trying to figure out if it's ever to conjure here. Are we ever holding this thing until it's crack and turn? Oh, I see. Hmm. I think it is conjure, right? Because we can fireball Blast Mage next turn as well. So I yeah. think conjure is actually correct here. Yeah. You want it? I thought she was coaching Shady. She, uh, Cece is actually really I'm barely good. talking. <laughs> like, right now she's a little quiet. She's tired. Uh, Flame Cannon's fine, Cece. And then we're just being played. Yeah. But Cece is one of the call partners who points out stuff where I pause and be like, no, you're right, let's do that. Fairly often. And that's, that's, uh, that really helps the, the co op. That's really good. So, this is not a coaching session, actually. For people that are. For people that don't know the stream at all, that's first time here. Very, very short. Uh, like, I can't play on my own because my wrists are bad. Now, we might be onto a solution for that, but that's not going to be uh, for a very. You know, it's not, not going to be a short time thing anyway. Uh, so, people like CC come on and help me out by playing co op arena so I can continue the stream. So, it's very appreciated. I guess we could still do your original line, right? With the mirror, or... Yeah. Oh, but you wanted mm. to get the mirror out for... Yeah, we can't really... We need to fireball the 5-5 five five and then yeah. ping trade scientist. It's fine. Oh, yeah, fireball. fireball the 5-5, five five, ping trade and scientist. You can't ping and crack, so it's not a great crack. It's okay. Yeah, I've tried touch screen, I've tried all the things. Um, I, I use a foot pedal as well. See, the problem the problem probably is, and I don't want to say it like with full certainty, but it makes super, it makes a lot of sense. I've had this problem for like three years now, right? And like every time I go and have an MRI taken and this and that, they see a little bit of damage here and there, but they're like, well, it shouldn't be causing this. But then they've, they've treated me, physical therapy, blah, blah, blah. Nothing really helps, right? Uh, and then this neurologist now says, like, well, let's get some blood work done. And he figured out uh, that my body might be incapable of dealing with inflammation. So his theory is that I'm pretty much just always inflamed. 
and that that is causing me to uh, not be able to play because if I use a foot mask for too long, I also get get issues. So that is the uh, like it might actually be solvable, which is great. Right? What, what are we doing do? here? What to do? Cannon. Yeah, cannon is okay, right? Six is going face, right? You're not yep, trading with this thing. Face. Six is going face. I think Creeper, Entity, Ping is fine. You might no longer have the luxury of playing around Mirror Entity. You don't want to play Blast Mage? No, I think Creeper and Ping is fine just in case he has removal so we can pick it up next turn. I want to see what that card is before I play Blast Mage. He's been holding this since turn one. Pretty sure you could play Hunter with a set of racing pedals. Well that's what I mean, right? If I use like a foot mouse or, or pedals for too long, I still I still get issues. Yeah, this way you can check for duplicate. Sure. Come on, buddy. Juicy minion. Let's play that Sunwalker. Deathwing. Death wing. We must cleanse the sun well. We must cleanse the sun well. What is it? What is it? Sure. It's been holding that since one. He he had no chance to play this the whole game, really. Yay! We can do things. Uh, yeah, I played this first. Yeah, we play that first. And then we ping the dwarf, trade the three, ping the three, pay, trade the one, go one face. Okay. I didn't know they were wrong, did I? I don't think there was a different way, right? I don't know, it well, seems right. There's a different way, but it's just worse. Like you suck everything. <laughs> there's, there is a worse way. Yeah, we could, we could have done it the worst way. Let's go for the 9 0 mage, guys. Finally, sure. oh, one. <laughs> oh, what just that? <laughs> Can I borrow your fall here? Uh, six, eleven. Not quite right. We just ping his guy twice. Play the blast mage. Ping face, go face. Yeah. So much pinging. Where is, where is the Domo? Yeah, if we get the Ragnaros hero power, we just like, eight, eight, eight. Never the worst way. Dragon Fire Potion doesn't do it. It needs to be a light bomb, pretty much. It's like, again! No light bomb, though. We might get the 12 HP potion. Does that even do it? 11, 16, I don't know. It's more mana. Yeah, oh, it, it oh. actually does it, yeah. It's kind of hard to explain. Okay. Did you figure out what was wrong with your ear? Like the ringing you on your left ear? Uh, here? No, it's probably, like, from what I'm thinking, it's probably uh, tinnitus through just, like, prolonged, like, Wearing a headset all the time and maybe like mm -hmm. sounds like maybe spikes being too loud, right? Because mm -hmm. uh, I've, I've always had like a slight ring in my left ear. Now like it, it just got a lot louder. Like this morning I just, uh, we just keep the two, right? Yeah. This morning I just woke up at like 5.30 because mm -hmm. it had like a super loud ring in my ear. It was crazy. It just mm -hmm. woke me up and like it was it's like, it's really weird. Uh, and is it True. even worse now? No, it's it's a lot better. Like once there's sound around me, it, it gets a lot better. It's, if there's like nothing going on, then it's pretty loud. Play well, two. Two. Uh, let me uh, read the chat and answer some questions, guys. Tiber asks, Shady, here's the situation wasn't yesterday, wonder what you do. Warlock v Warlock, you have 6 HP, play the tank of face, yeah. Uh, you have 15, he has 5 cards. The only thing on the board is a 2 5 belonging to my opponent. You have Time Rewinder, Power Overwhelming, and Zombie Chow, you play the Zombie Chow. Crystals and Crystals. 
You have nothing else. You have, just have a PO in your hand. Instantly? I wouldn't I wouldn't play the uh uh yeah, we we replay that guy for sure. I wouldn't I wouldn't play the chow no. I'd probably hold it with five cards in the hand, it's not gonna Do work. you wanna trade? No? No no no. That's oh. an insult to RNG. He will give us bad RNG if we do that. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was just afraid if it hits only one. It's it fine. If awkward. it hits only once, it's you missed like you missed, damage, like a little yeah. bit of you don't I, I don't even think you missed damage and this is just maximum damage for sure. Mind if I roll need? My mouth very very close. Nope. 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 Mech mage guys, it's pretty good. <laughs> no. Yeah, we we play conjure, right? Sure. You want it? Curving. Curving oh. guy. Oh. Uh, so this is actually good to think about for a second. After what yeah. we pick here, we probably push five, trading the loot order with the tank. Serpent is at 17. We pick the frost bolt. We have uh, 9, 10, 18 lined up already. I would just go for reach. I'd just pick frost bolt. I think Tom's too slow. Then I would use yeah. the tank to kill the loot order and champ five. I agree. Just on damage. More damages. So he still has coin. You have to be careful for coin abyssal next turn. Dark bomb. It's okay. Whoa. Lava Drake in five phase is probably just fine here. Yep. Let's do it. Job done. Got this. Like if you have any stealth, for instance, Tiber, right? Definitely hold the chat out. It, re it really depends on what's left in your deck, man. I'd, I'd need to see your deck list and then I could give you a proper answer. My instinct tells me don't play the child, but I need to see your list. If there's like zero chance you get there. Okay. Tom in that case is essentially a 7 on the frostball. Yeah, you're only gonna tell me what for reach anyway, so let's just not be silly and pick the reach. Your soul shall be mine! You asked for it. Your soul shall be mine. Is that the same guy? Nope. Okay. So what are you thinking with this hand, CC? We're keeping the... Someone said it's called Mom. We're keeping the Mom. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, the Mom, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I've never used the abbreviation for that. And let's not, be in, let's not start doing that either. Someone told me that today. I was like, what? <laughs> Um, just keep the ones uh, for me. Yeah, and the ultra, right? Yeah, just just the ones, just the one mana cards. Ditch the three, ditch the six. Oh, oh my god, it's so good. The mulligan. Good job, CC. This is looking ah. pretty good. Is Play this? the one. Yep. Side effects. No, trust me. <laughs> Keep the squid. <laughs> That's a nice draw. We can play that instead of the fallen hero. Fallen hero can you can. No, I want to play the thespian. Death. I want to play the thespian instead of the fallen hero. An autograph. I suppose. This only works on the simple-minded. Crusader? Yep, Crusader and trade. Thing going phase there is probably right. It's just a couple things that annoy me. I think Demon Wrath is kind of annoying. Imploding is kind of annoying. <gasps> Holy! <gasps> what is going on today? People are just throwing stuff at us, like, here, take it! Take everything! 
Do you want coin the five? Probably. You could also just go fall on here on Elvenotra and say, I don't want it. It's not good enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> my reasoning is that you can play the Silver Hand into Abyssal, kind of. You can't play the others into Abyssal. I'm not sure whether the reasoning is entirely yeah. correct. Uh, so let's just compare board sense, that. right? 4-4, four, 2-2, four, 3-1, two, two, uh, four, three, two, one, one, three, one, Divine Shield. It's pretty close, but I guess we just coined the Silver Hand. Or... So, do we ever play the twos? Huh. No. No, we coined the Silver Hand. It's fine. It gives us so much options, we should probably be able to... Uh, oh, should probably be able to deal with that. Ready, sir. Oh, wow. Do you think going strong into drops is the way to go with Mage right now? Yeah, I, I, I said this I said this at the start, like in the draft. I'll talk about it in a minute. But So no coin, no this on next turn. So do we all in with the Fallen Hero Ping and Alvin Archer? So that would jam... 7 9 phase this turn. Opponent mm -hmm. goes to 19. Develops. Maybe Dread. We have 3. Uh, 7 9. He goes to 10. The Abyssal puts him down to 7. But he'd probably want to trade something into the Dread. Huh. What to do? The other one is trade this guy. Trade this guy, Archer, trade, trade. No, I think Fallen Hero is guy, Elven is guy, Ping is guy. Gem. So yeah, Fallen Hero, Ping, Elven is guy, and Push is correct. Yeah. I think we want to get the maximum damage out here. It's a little risky, right? Because if he has exactly Dread into Abyssal, it might be a little bit short. But if he has, you know, whatever into Abyssal, this actually probably gets us there. I like this. Okay. Sure. 7, 9, 10, 11, 14 damage in total if you have his souls. kind of feel like trading a bit, I'm not sure if it's right. Because you could use the 3-1, the 1-1, one, 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 and the ping. You could also use the 3 and the 2 and then push 5 and play these. That's silly, right? 3-1, ping, push 6, face. Have 3 to 2, this souls useless. So one play pushes six phase, the other play it's just worse. It's just strictly worse. Yeah, so we just use the three, the one, and the ping to kill it, and then play yeah. spider tank, push six. Yep. Yeah, he hasn't shown any answers, so this is probably better. This is best playing around this story. Yeah, I was just thinking if there was any any world where we just develop and ignore, but we don't get there and he gets to play a really good card, so... Oh. Wow. <laughs> good at the game, I know. <laughs> so good at this game, CC. Alright, so yeah, Polly ping. Well, Polly is guy for sure. Jam everything face for sure. So we'll get that out of the way. I just want to see if there's a world where we ping his face instead. No, I think Polly is guy and ping is guy as well. I don't think we need to uh, push face. Do you ever want... oh, never mind. Like, I have a list threats with like four Cabal Couriers, and like zero minions on four, zero minions on five. Plus 12-0, <laughs> it's just so good. Oh my god, this curve! How do you do it, CZ? So good! <laughs> what? Uh, throw the Polymore? Yeah, throw the Polymore. Get a one? Yeah? Um, Wait. More like in the last match. <laughs> okay. But keep the other three, right? Yeah, keep the other three. Just draw a blast match and we're good. Oh no, I didn't. Okay, we got a few turns. Why does it say 10 0? Because we played it to the early on and the bot is totally confused. He doesn't know that Tirana is a thing. <laughs> oh wow. So weird. It's happening today. doing all kinds of weird shit. Everybody's practicing for the ability to glory. 
Yeah, we're huh? just like practicing today, like this month, and I'm like not playing serious yet. Quite wrong? Yeah. Oh, come on! More diggies in chat, guys. Any more diggy per minute? Let's go. <laughs> it's like, it just shifts the problem. <gasps> Thespian, making your power? Yeah, with Thespian. We want to encourage you there, so the tanks are nice. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Here we go! It's a chunky just boss match! Pew 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 pew! Pew 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 pew! Ah, he does it! Alright, so we need to dodge to drop at this rate, and now we're good. That's exactly what we want to see. Go, tank! Let's go! And turn instant. Play a two two B dagger. Oh! <laughs> is a three one good as last well, season? I don't know. It's good, right? Yep, slam it in the face. Full confidence. Oh. I missed it. Oh, you can see now. Rogue's gonna see about Yeah. <laughs> I like I like the pause. Just like no, no concede. <laughs> You sure you want to keep playing? Uh, oh, this is so crazy. dumb. This is so dumb. Um, oh, I can't think of it. Hmm. Okay, well, they're both going face. Yes, they are. Yeah, I think it's just Scientist and Creeper. Because it's like, MCT is the one thing, and I think holding it, especially because we need the one ping to go back into the night, not playing the Creeper it doesn't make sense, and Scientist is just too good. Oh, this is cheating. <laughs> cheating again. If you'd like, if you'd like, you can see now. Go ahead. It's an option. Bottom right corner. Easy. Oh. Ouch. No. Hmm. Oops. I have to fireball that. Yeah. It's just like the mana is kind of off the There's no crazy, crazy other line here. We could get the Maiden out and then Frost Bolt, trade with the tank, trade with the two, trade with the Creeper to fireball for face. It's the Maiden. Yeah. I think I like that more, right? Yeah. Fireball and not play anything. It's oh, correct, right? So three, three, three. Yeah, so Maiden, far right. Frost Bolt to Taunt, trade the tank and the Scientist, and then trade the far one with the Creeper. Yeah, this is better. This is why it's good to like Miles, because I think yeah, most of the time I would just sound the fireball and it's like... Yeah, it's, Me too. This is good because you save your fireball, your tank is still alive. You played your 2-6. This is run feels easy. We are drawing really well. Our deck is strong <laughs> and our opponents are playing poorly. Well, playing slash drawing poorly. Some people have made some weird decisions so far. And they just don't <gasps> have answers. Uh, they are cheap control shit. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> That's our second 12-0 thing, right, Susan? Uh, yeah. The Hunter also. Yeah, no, the Hunter. Yeah. Yeah. A 12 of a 0, guys. A 12-0. Oh, yeah, 12-0, guys. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. We can't, can't do it with the Alba Noucher. Got him! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was worth staying up for. <laughs> CC is the good MVP, guys. Oh, look at those five packs ready and waiting, guys. All right, let's open them up. Sure. Yeah. I mean, you can't complain. It's tokens. <laughs> 
It's usually people get like bad rewards for twelve. Like, oh, it's so bad. It's like, dude, you just like paid one fifty and got all of this out of it. So. Oh, we got a golden. What is that? Double gangster, yeah. Last week I got a um, twelve old warlock, and then it gave me a legendary on one of the boxes. Oh, or a warlock nice. legendary. All right. All right, CC. I will let you go off to bed. This is, uh, <laughs> All right. Awesome. That was fun. Fun as usual.